New tonight, in the last 24 hours, Livermore police have received more than a dozen calls concerning this man, Andy Nisbet. He is the well-known youth golf pro accused of sex crimes against children. Crown Force J.R. Stone talked with police who now have three detectives on this case. Here are a few tips to try to help you out. This is Livermore youth golf instructor Andy Nisbet, a man who's behind bars this evening, accused of committing dozens of sex crimes against young boys. His intentions were uh, evil when he hosted these parties. Officer Steve Gord of Livermore PD says Nisbet would throw parties for the teens that he used to teach. He says those parties involved underage drinking. I don't think it was publicly known that he involved alcohol, but you know, he's the adult, he's the cool coach, and this is where he kind of gained the notoriety of, hey, he's great, he's nice, providing alcohol, you know, kids feel a little bit liber liberated. Since our story on Nisbet's arrest aired on Tuesday, dozens of calls have come into the Livermore Police Department. Department. Parents concerned about their child's safety. Officer Gord says so far they know of three victims between the ages of 12 and 17. He says that Nisbet preyed on boys, not girls, and would commit sex crimes against those boys in a number of locations. At his house, in his car, throughout the town of Livermore, on these trips, out of state from what we're hearing at the golf course parking lot. So he definitely knew how to market himself, uh, which ultimately gained him access to just you know, hundreds to thousands of kids throughout the United States. On Wednesday, I talked with a parent who had just heard the news about Coach Nisbet. As we were discussing the issue, both her children under the age of 10 kept saying, what happened to Coach Andy? Where did Coach Andy go? At that point, she hadn't yet told them that he had been taken to jail. In Livermore, J.R. Stone, Cron 4 News.